Hello Botsifiers. So in this video, I'm going to tell you how you can set up your white label portal. So first of all, if you have purchased the white label package of Botsify, under your profile settings, you would see an option to set up your white label settings. So if I click on this white label option, I will be presented with this section. In the first page, I have to fill out my white label settings and then install the SSL on my uh, desired URL. So before we further move into this, a very crucial thing for you to understand that is a, your white label portal, which will look something like uh, this, does not allow your end users to register in your account. So in order to create your client account, what you have to do is um, create a chatbot within your Botsify portal and then with the help of sub user, you will be inviting your end customers and your end customers will get an invite along with the email and password which they can use in order to log in into your white label portal so that is how it process basically it gives you a flexibility to add your payment information or collect the pay payment however you want from your customers maybe you make your own uh, on onboarding flow and uh, after you collect the payment information from your customer you redirect them to this uh, and URL of your uh, white label portal but anyway let's move forward so first of all I have to give my company name then I have to give my main main domain name and then I have to give my mask URL my mask URL is where my uh, white label portal will be installed I want it to be installed on my subdomain like chatbot.sizepeakers.com my SMTP, port, uh, SMTP host basically we take this information in order to send the emails like the notification emails alert emails to your end customer on behalf of your email address uh, or your email domain rather than partsify.com so in order to set it up if you have the account on G Suite your host would be something like smtp.gmail.com if you have um, any other email service provider like Outlook or SendGrid, feel free to reach out to them or search on Google what is your host and uh, port. In my uh, case, my port is 587. My email address is this and my password is, let's say, this. And after, uh, after that, I will set up my logo and my desired color theme and then hit the submit button once I have given the uh, uh, information I will be asked to set up a CNM report on my DNS so you see for the CNM chatbot dot says I have to provide this value I will copy the value and then go to uh, my domain name provider which in this case is Namecheap I'll, uh, I'll add a record like CNAME chatbot and then this URL white label dot Botsify mail dot com. Now uh, coming back to Botsify, once I have set up the CNAME record, I can test my domain. It will verify if you have correctly set up your CNAME record, and then I will install my SSL certificate. So this will uh, basically redirect my domain chatbot dot dot com to be HTTPS, so that it's uh, secure for my end uh, customers to access the URL. So once that is done, you will get this message uh, SSL successfully installed. Let's go to our subdomain in order to test it out. I, did, I didn't get my logo, so I'll go ahead and set it up again. Let's see if this works. There you go. So this way you will be able to set up your white label portal and your uh, once you have uh, set up your white label portal, you will go to sub accounts. Uh, for example, I go to sub account for this particular chatbot and uh, add my first sub account. And for the sub account, I will uh, go to um, I will invite one of my friends. Let's say Sheros on his email address. If he had not, if he had not created the account, he would uh, be given his name and password as well in order to access the account. 
I hope you like the video and you understand. If you have any confusion, feel free to reach out team at potsify.com in order to set up your white level portal correctly.